If you're watching this video, then you're probably looking for the fastest way to farm ingredients for the Heavenly Ramen course. The truth is that there's no fastest way to farm these materials, but with a little bit of knowledge, you can plan out your personal farming method a little bit better. Now, I'm going to cover all the ingredients in this video, but the most time-consuming one is easily the extra fatty giant fish. You get this guy by fishing at any of the fishing spots located throughout the game. Personally, I like the one in Laco Village because this is also a prime spot to get everything you need for the boiled treasure of the sea course, but we'll get to that a little later in the video. Now, if you're having trouble getting extra fatty giant fish, or if you just want to speed up the process, I highly recommend using Holy Crab Fishing Bait. The main difference between the S, M, and Z levels of this bait is how many times you can fish before the effect wears off. Once for S, twice for M, and thrice for Z. Three times, whatever. You can find Holy Crab Fishing Bait near several fishing spots, mostly in the East Ravine area and the Southeast Island areas. The locations are not randomized, but the quality of those items are. There's really no best way to farm these either, just be aware of where they spawn. Oh, and quick tip, you can also use the save load trick at any of the fishing spots to force these guys to respawn. Now, with that out of the way, let's get into the rest of the ingredients. To make the heavenly ramen course, you need to have five other meals made. Heap of meat ramen z, extra soft crumbly fried rice, boiled treasure of the sea, super ultra dumpling, and rich cupcake. The heap of ramen z requires golden wheat, prime marble dino meat, and premium golden fish eggs. Extra soft crumbly fried rice requires shiny rice, premium eggs, and high quality carrots. The boiled treasure of the sea requires extra fatty giant fish, which we already covered earlier, golden energetic fish, aromatic, ar aromatic, I don't know, aromatic herb, and fatty giant fish. The super ultra dumplings require shiny rice and high quality bean paste, and the rich cupcakes require premium milk, superb apples, and superb peaches. All of these ingredients can be farmed in three main areas. Yamcha's Hideout, Lako Village, and the Sacred Land of Korin. Granted, these aren't the only places you can get them, but this is where I go to get them. For the heap of ramen z, golden wheat can be bought from a vendor, while prime marble dino meat can be farmed from the two dinosaurs that spawn at Yamcha's Hideout. Simply use the save load trick from my Soul Emblem Max Level Trick video. Essentially, just make a manual save after you kill the dinosaurs, then load that manual save and the dinosaurs will respawn. Please note that sometimes you need to move a bit away from the area to get both to respawn. Premium golden fish eggs can be found underwater near where you see birds flying above the surface. A prime spot for these is the fishing spot at Laco Village. For the extra soft crumply fried rice, Shiny rice, premium eggs, and high-quality carrots can all be purchased at a food vendor. There is one conveniently located at Laco Village. If you're strapped for Zenny, simply farm Ultimate Awakening Waters and sell them. If you don't know how to do that, I'll leave a link in the description below to a guide I made on just how to do this. For the boiled treasure of the sea, extra fatty giant fish can be caught by fishing at Laco Village. You'll also catch regular fatty giant fish more often than the extra fatty ones, so there's that. Golden energetic fish is found in the same place as the premium golden fish eggs, so that's another two birds with one stone, so to speak. Aromatic herbs can be found by the oasis at Yamcha's hideout when you're farming the dino meat, so yet another two birds, one stone situation. And as far as the shiny rice and high quality bean paste for the super ultra dumplings, both can be bought from vendors, so no need wasting your time trying to farm those. You'd be more efficient just farming the ultimate awakening waters. It should only take you 30 seconds to a minute to farm each, depending on how fast your hard drive is, and each water sells for 12,000 zenny a pop. So in an hour, you should be able to get, if we do our math correctly, over a million zenny. Lastly, for the rich cupcakes, you can buy premium milk from the vendor, while superb apples and superb peaches can be found all over the land of Corin Zone. And that's it. 
Guys, if this video was helpful and you're still here with me at the end, please let me know in the comments below and definitely make sure to like and subscribe. Doing that is easily the best way to show your support. And until next time, stay safe, stay blessed, and stay tuned to ICE TV.